oh my god, I literally can't deal with this anymore. I can't do this. I can't do it. I can't do it. So obviously, this is a whole introduction thing. We're getting into the intro of the video, getting into the swing of things. She just filmed a whole intro, speaking to you for a good four minutes. And I deleted it by accident. So we're going to restart it. Hello guys, today it's a little casual night with me. So obviously I've done like night routines and stuff like that, but I've never done like a casual night with me. And I just like these casual vlogs, so it's really steady, just really easy going and just like calm and all that. So obviously she's very annoyed right now that she's just deleted it, but she's not going to let that get in the way. We're just going to repeat everything I've said. So I've done my workout obviously, but... I don't like to have people watch me work out. I don't know what it is, but I just don't like it. So I didn't bring you guys along for that. But I've just finished my protein shake um, and it was vanilla. For all of you wondering. I know some people like, like the chocolate ones and stuff, but personally, I just don't like them. Like, I've never been a fan of chocolate milk. I don't like chocolate ice cream. Like, I don't know anything like that. I don't like chocolate bars, but I don't know when they're in ice cream or milky form. Like, I just don't like it at all. I think it's disgusting. Um, like if I ever got a milkshake, I'll probably get like the strawberry ones or something, like a strawberry milkshake, you know, the classic. Or, you know, when places do like homemade milkshakes and you do like the raspberry milkshakes and put the syrup at the bottom and the milk and then the syrup like seeps into the milk but then you have still have the syrup at the bottom. So when you stir it, it just, oh. They're so beautiful when they do that. I just, they're out of this world when they do that. But right now we are going to be getting ready for a little cooking session. So we're going to do some cooking tonight. We're going to do some skincare we're going to do some relaxing we're going to do some chit chatting um but right now we're going to go cook some tea because i'm hungry and it is 1748 and that's not even the song i was like 17 it's not even 17 is it i don't really know what it is but it's 1749 so 10 to 6 and i'm hungry and i'm having salmon for my tea tonight so i need to go and make some of that and then yeah we're gonna crack into the rest of the video. There's no broccoli! You're joking! So we currently have a battery flashing symbol and also my salmon decided to be there but there was no broccoli as you would have seen um so we're not having salmon for tea tonight we are just having some soup and it is this like super bean soup so it's got sweet potato beans and all the jazz in let me show you this is what it looks like this is what it looks like you're probably all gonna think that looks like sick but we're having that with some salad on the side instead so i'm gonna make this and i'm gonna switch to my phone vlogging while we get this battery charged hi okay, guys she's on the phone like she said she's found a nice little tripod oh my this is actually like a proper good angle like why have i never thought about this before like hi um right now she's just stirring a soup because this soup takes like 10 minutes to warm up it's got like sweet potato in and stuff so it's all like thick you know like normal like heinz tomato soup isn't but no i was just thinking about it right i'm having soup for my tea but like the reason i never have soup for my tea and never for my lunch is because soup never satisfies me then i get late night cravings and that's never good like last night I ate like 10 rich tea biscuits. I know, I know. It was bad. It was bad. She couldn't stop. She couldn't stop. But you know when you're, like, you're talking to someone and they're eating, so then it makes you want to eat. Like, I don't know. They just make you want to eat. So then I ate 10 rich tea biscuits. I know. I know it wasn't necessary, but it happened. I feel like I am going to get cravings, but tonight you are going to be joining me for an episode of trying new foods with Millie. So basically on my Snapchat, I have this little story where I try new food because I am a very fussy eater. Well, I used to be a lot, lot fussier. Like, I would never eat this when I was a fussy eater. Like, I don't know. And I've just become less fussy. I've been open to trying new foods. So, like, on the little story, you know how people have, like, a private story? Well, I have this story. And there's only, I think, about 11 people in it maximum. I think maybe about nine of them, actually. And um, just try new foods. So, it's like, tonight I'm going to be trying celery that's a hint for one of them but i think i'm trying one two three tonight i want to say there's three yeah no four four sorry i'm trying four different tonight he said it'd be a fruit or a vegetable she put it in the salad so i want to say it's a vegetable it's like a salad veg i don't really know don't even ask me um but yeah you can join me for that and honestly it's a whole experience like she's so dramatic because in me she me 
Um, so it is a dramatic one every time I do try and eat food, but it is exciting at the same time. So I can't wait for you to join me with that. But right now we're just going to wait for this to keep bubbling its, to its little heart's content. And then we're going to sit and eat it and I'll catch up with you once my stomach is not even satisfied at all. It's food baby moment. She has finished her food. It was gorgeous. And I put like a Warburton's protein thins bagel with it. Oh, oh, it was amazing. But right now it's shower time. Obviously I've been at the gym. She's got all stinky. She needs a shower. So I'm going to go shower in privacy. Not with you guys because that would be weird. Um, and then I'll see you after my shower. And I forgot I'm baking tonight as well. I am baking a cake. Anyone else do this? Like, you know you need to clean your room. Like, look at my bin. Now, I know I need to get all that sorted. I know I do. But I'm sat right here, comfortably on my floor, watching TikTok. Like, that all needs to be cleaned as well. But I just don't want to do it. I just don't want to do it. But I know I need to. I need to clean my room. I've been in the shower, going to some PJs. I know I need to clean my room. So that's the thing I need to do. And, and I also need to clean my room first. And then I'm going to go and bake the cake, which you guys are going for. And then we're also going to try new foods. We're going to try new foods. And then that'll be pretty much the end of the night. So we've still got a bit of action-packed evening to go along. This is rather action-packed evening. I don't know how I feel about it. Loki feel a bit productive. I don't know if I like that feeling, though. Do I like that feeling? Oh, and I also need to sort of Christmas present because me being organised this year, she has organised Christmas presents for everyone. Um, Just because I feel like 2020 has been a year and I feel like my Christmas present is a proper, like, cute present like it's so thoughtful i've never done something like this like ever my mum normally just buys presents then just put my name on it so i'm actually really excited like i'm actually been so so thoughtful like so thoughtful who would have thought it me being thought thoughtful what time to bake the cake and she is so excited because she is baking a malted milk Mary Berry cake it's the classic one with the maltese on the top that's why it's called malted milk and it also has drinking chocolate in it which is why she's doing it and you might think why the hell is she baking a cake like that's so random but well, it's my nana's birthday tomorrow which is my mum's mum and obviously we can't see her so i thought what we'll do is just bake her a cake and then at least she's got a cake because she loves a good chocolate cake on her birthday and i've made this one before and she liked it so i thought i'd do it again hoping she likes it so i'm not going to talk you through it we're not going to do a full-on bake with me because that could be another video if you guys want another bake with me then let me know because she loves baking um so we're just going to do like a little montage of me just baking and having the time of my life at half past eight and that'll mean i won't finish until about half past nine but you know you've got to do what you've got to do and like i said this year i am feeling very generous we are gonna crack straight into baking and i'm so excited i'm so excited what is that off? The way the person goes, oh my god, I'm so excited! Is that off anything or is that me just being autistic? Mm, well, I don't know. in the oven behind me here they're going for 20 to 25 minutes um so i thought what better time is it than to try new foods so i'm gonna get all the foods out and we are gonna try them and you're gonna think i'm weird that i haven't tried some of these but just trust me yeah i'm just gonna try them all right so first of all we have strawberries which i know a lot of people do like strawberries but i've just never liked them i have tried them before ages ago but i was very close-minded so i want to try them again open-minded because you know the appetite's a bit better these days pineapple never ever ever tried pineapple so and all my friends say oh my god you tried pineapple so that is what i'm gonna do and it's low-key a little bit frozen because our fridge seems to freeze things at the back i don't know why next we have a melon a honeydew melon i'm pretty sure it is i've tried watermelon and i hated it but so we're gonna try some melon and then lastly we're gonna try some celery because i've always wanted to try celery because i like how it sounds um and i feel like it could just be nice so we're gonna try some celery this i'm not looking at you guys have so this is a strawberry i'm gonna try the strawberry first Okay. 
Why are they good? Why have I never had them before? I've got a bit mouldy. They are about five days out of date, but we don't need to talk about that. It's blessed before, not used by, so it's fine. Oh my god. Why are strawberries so good? So that is a yes for strawberries. The next one we're gonna go for is celery. I am very nervous about this one. Just because it's gone a bit funny in the end, so let's just snap it in half. This is very salady, and I don't know if I'm gonna like that. Ah, it smells like sour. But you know what them people like to walk around there? <laughs> celery. You know them people, I don't know. Not them people, you know what I mean? Like people walk around like, oh my god, celery, it's so fit. Like what, raw carrots, like, I don't get it, okay. Three, two, one. probably tell i didn't like that one didn't like that one so we are moving swiftly on before that puts me off the rest of the foods pineapple is next so this one so i've had a call from my friends say you need to try pineapple well it was ella first and then i was like okay and then i can't remember who else was me i was like okay you know what? i'm gonna try pineapple stop peer pressuring me so she's trying pineapple I don't like the colour. Like, it's got like bits on the end of it. I'll show you guys in a second. It's got like bits on the end of it. See that? See that? All right. How do you eat pineapple? It's a weird texture. Meant to pull it apart? I don't hate it. Mmm. Actually, I quite like it. It low key tastes like apples. Anyone else ever get that? <laughs> Anyone else think that? That was a bit crunchy, that one. Okay, I didn't like that one. Try this one. I can't stop chucking the pineapple everywhere. Mm. I mean, I won't go out of my way to buy it again, but it is good. I like pineapple. I like pineapple. So, so far, I like pineapple, I like strawberries, I don't like celery. That pineapple bit was a bit hard. The next one we're going to try is a honeydew melon, but I have no idea how to cut this, so we're just going to go for it. So we're going to cut it like a pizza. <laughs> I know you ought to, you're probably going to be cringing. Okay, maybe we're not cutting it like a pizza. Apparently, we're cutting it all the way through. Okay, do you want to cut it like a pizza? Mm, it's green. So I'm just going to slice a section out of it and just like pierce it out. <laughs> you're all probably cringing because I don't know how to eat this if not. So now you normally have like melon, you have it like that and you go <sighs> But like she doesn't have the effort to do that. Okay, she's nervous. She's really nervous for this one because I don't like watermelon, which means I might not like this. I'm sweating, I'm gonna take my jumper off. Hang on a minute, guys. Whew. She is sweating. Right. I think it does help I was hungry, but I'm not even hungry, that's why I don't think I want to eat it. Oh my, it smells like watermelon, oh my god. It's green! It's green. I mean, I don't hate it. Like, I don't hate it, but I wouldn't eat it. Like, it's nothing like the pineapple. Oh, it's nicer than watermelon. 100% nicer than watermelon. It goes hard. Like, it's green. Like, I don't think you understand, it's literally green. It's green. So there we have it, ladies and gentlemen. I don't like melon, I like strawberries, and I like pineapple. Oh my God, they are out of the oven. Oh my God. They are now out of the oven, and they were cooking for like half an hour. It said 20, 25 minutes, but they were still gooey, so I put them on for an extra like five minutes, and it turned out perfect, and they smell amazing. Like They actually smell so good. So, um, she's made herself a green tea while she's been waiting for just waiting for tea bag to diffuse for three minutes. Got a cheeky little green tea. Um, and then she's gonna head straight up to bed. I mean, for skincare wise, um, I literally just washed my face in the shower earlier and I moisturized my face earlier. So I don't think there's anything else I'm gonna do. Um, 
so that is pretty much it for the night like we've spent the night together she's got a green tea she's gonna have a hot hot lemon water after but i'm trying to find a spoon but there isn't one so we're just gonna use a big spoon um she's gonna have a hot lemon water after but that is literally the evening spent with me like i don't do anything else really other than like go to bed do a few facetime calls you know the drill um so that is it i hope you enjoyed me trying new foods i mean i hope it was entertainment um, and i just hope you enjoyed spending the night with me because you know i enjoyed spending the night with you and um, that sounds really wrong so yeah hug hug so thank you so so much for watching and we'll see you next time for a new video i'm hoping my mum's in the next one i feel like she might be mm, we'll see well yeah thank you so so much for watching and we will see you next time bye and honestly that cake looks divine oh hate to get so big-headed about it but at the same time i don't hate to get big-headed about it it looks gorgeous bye